we wanted to uh, explain to you guys something that I, I've never really, I've never really heard anybody fully explain before, uh, and it's something that I think creates a lot of confusion when uh, fans are watching um, fights or watching grappling, and that's the, that's what's a what is a Kimura uh, or a double wrist lock versus a hammer lock, and uh, the the Kimura is actually the name of a person. Uh, Kimura was a, a Japanese judo player um, who was famous for locking his hold on uh, Helio Gracie, I believe. And uh, the move existed long before uh, Kimura was around. And it was uh, the position is a double wrist lock position, and it's a much different position than a hammer lock. There's a slight variation uh, that makes it different. So what we're gonna do is we'll say Jason's here and. Uh, so you can space your feet this way. This is the double wrist lock position. I have a hold of his wrist. We like to go up high on it and take the thumb at the same time. And what I want to do is I want to come over. I want to make sure that I'm coming up above his elbow joint when I do it. And I want to come over here and I want to lock my own hand. I'm going to go here closer to the camera so you can see what I'm doing. I'm locking my own hand here. So I'm going over and locking my own hand. Now, when I get this move on Jason, like say for example, Jason was in a top position and he was forcing me down, and I would get this move on him, what I'm gonna do is, from here, I'm gonna drop him down. I'm not gonna just follow along the line of his back. I don't wanna do that because he can grab his shirt. What I wanna do is I wanna go up and away, uh, and, and that will put the pressure on his shoulder and uh, cause the tap. Now that, that's different, that's a double wrist lock, or what a lot of people now will call Kimura. A hammer lock is, is a slightly different to, um, positioning of the hands. What a hammer lock is, is, say we were in that same position here, Jason was coming in, I'm going to go under his arm as opposed to over his arm. And I'm going to come up here, see where that, the hammer lock is? Up under his arm, and a hammer lock, you're gonna you can do the same thing. You're gonna pull him up, and you can even get the wrist lock from here. So that's a hammer lock. So the the difference is in the double wrist lock. I'm over his arm, grab my own wrist, and a hammer lock. I'm under his arm, and the hammer lock is more like a restraint hold. Same thing. I'm gonna try to tie my arm behind his back. Uh, so hopefully that'll that'll give you guys an idea of the difference between a double wrist lock and a hammer lock. Thank you, and everybody. This is Jason Lawrence. Uh, we've been on uh, several of our instructional videos now. Uh, he's uh, from a boxing background, and he's moving into MMA. Uh, he's been training with us diligently. Uh, his grappling has come along very well. He's becoming a ferocious on the mat, and uh, he'll be fighting up in Chesapeake, Virginia, uh, coming up in February. So thanks everybody for checking out AmericanCombatASSN.com.